One game that Ethan and I invented was that we would hold our willies against a hot radiator for as long as we could. <laughs> And he would always win. <laughs> I'm very proud of my daughter, Anna, of the woman she has become and how stunningly beautiful. <laughs> stunningly beautiful she looks today. <laughs> My father, uh, once said of me that Philip could do a lot of things. He could drive a boat, drive a car, drive a nail, drive a cricket ball through the covers, even drive a scrum. But I also had the ability to drive crazy. And I'm proud to say that you too, Ethan, have all those abilities. <laughs> including driving me crazy. <laughs> crazy with admiration, with pride and joy. You're a wonderful son, Ethan, and brother. I can't even read this because my hand's shaking that much. <laughs> and your mother and I are extremely proud of you and all your achievements through life. things come in small packages and Anna is one of the loveliest, most genuine and kindest and officially the smallest person I know. <laughs> She's been my favourite English person for a good 10-11 years <laughs> until I met her mum Christine, <laughs> my new dance partner. I think we can all agree that Ethan and Anna are everybody's favourite couple. And we are also glad to be here today celebrating with you both after a long 11 years. <laughs> are you sure you haven't rushed into it? <laughs> Every day I'm thankful for meeting you and what we have achieved since we met. And over the past 11 years, I've seen you grow and blossom like the beautiful flower that you are. <laughs> <laughs> Ethan, you wear your heart on your sleeve and I promise I will always be there to protect it. I promise if you ever have a hard day, I will always be there with a massive hug and a funny story to make you smile. Now, I can't promise to stop singing songs when I don't know the lyrics, <laughs> insisting on cuddles every night before bed, and I definitely can't promise to stop paying pranks on you and to steal all your comfy hoodies and t-shirts. But I promise that my love for you will never ever falter, that I will stand by your side as we figure out the journey ahead, whatever comes our way. At times you drive me crazy, but I'm crazily in love with you, and I carry your heart and I carry it in my heart. <laughs> I take you as my friend, lover and wife, in laughter and in tears, in conflict and tranquility, asking that you be no other than yourself, loving what I know of you, trusting what I do not yet know. In all the ways that life may find us, 
never above you, never below you, always beside you. I promise to be the best husband I can be. Thank you for all that you do for me, for us. Thank you for pushing me to do all the things, to do all those things I didn't want to do. Thank you for making me a far better person than I was when we met. Thank you for being my beautiful ray of sunshine. You're my inspiration. I love you. Since the day we met, you have made me the happiest man on earth. You're such a loving, 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 kind, selfless person, and your strength and humility never fails to amaze me. Little did I know, the spark that flickered on the dance floor of Bushwhackers in Worcester <laughs> would become a fire that burns inside my soul. I obviously knew the way to your heart was two cherry VKs for a fiver. <laughs> Over the last 11 years, being by your side and growing together has been my inspiration. Getting to spend every day with your best mate is something most people could only dream of, and that means you've made my dreams come true. To put it quite simply, Anna, you're the best person I've ever met. I love you. Uh, so please, if you're able, could you stand, raise your glasses, raise your voice, with a massive toast to Anna, my wife, together uh, a long time ago and, uh, and he hopped out of the bath and I noticed what I thought was a new toy and grasped at it with my, with my greedy little fist. Uh, alas my friends it was a big fat poo. Uh, and in the words of Abba it was slipping through my fingers. 